in this video we are going to understand about the properties of minus 1 and its exponents now we all know that 1 into 1 into 1 you may use any number of ones the product is always 1 okay you may have 1 three times so 1 to the power 3 1 to the power 10 or 1 to the power 100 everywhere this is equal to 1 but this is not the similar case with minus 1 so if you have let's say minus 1 into minus 1 1 times 1 gives us what 1 minus into minus gives us plus but if you have minus 1 into minus 1 into minus 1 then what happens So, if you multiply these two together, this will give you one into minus one. Again, one into one gives you one. Plus into minus gives you minus. So this is interesting. When you you multiplied minus one by itself two times, you got plus one. Whereas when you did it three times, you got minus one. Let's do it four times. Minus one into minus one into minus one into minus one. Let's form pairs. One pair, two pair. Minus one into minus one. We saw it here is equal to one into again minus one into one is equal to one. So I got one. Now this is again interesting. Here it was one. Here it was minus one, and here it is one. Now generally for minus one, the way it works in terms of exponents is that if minus one has an even exponent then the value will always be 1 which means plus 1 whereas if a minus 1 has an odd exponent this will always be equal to minus 1 So minus one with an even exponent is always equal to one, and minus one with an odd exponent is always equal to minus one. And this is true for any number of exponent which minus one has. Okay. 